So Josh, another big myth that people say about cryptocurrency mining and why they don't do it is because they say, oh, it's probably too difficult, it's probably too technical, you know, I'll never be able to get my head around it. Is that true or false? Yeah, it's ultimately false. Um, there's a lot of software out there now that's just super simple. You know, there's, you know, one-touch mining solutions. You can take home a bit of kit, plug it in, turn it on and off you go. So, you know, as we discussed previously, we've sold to retired couples or, you know, people that aren't necessarily super techy. Um, it's it's definitely something that's available to everybody now. You know, you don't have to do all coding and do kind of crazy wallet management and all this type of stuff. Like anything, you can go down the rabbit hole as deep as you want to. You can, you know, make it a bit more complicated if you want a bit more control. But fundamentally, the basics are, you know, there's, there's applications and software out there. Things like NiceHash, which make it super simple. You know, you just press go. Um, so if you had one of these GeForce 1080 Ti's in your gaming computer anyway, yeah. you you potentially got the power to start mining. Absolutely. Straight yeah. away. Like, yeah, you know, download one program, push, off you go, press a big green start button, and it's literally that simple. And it will figure out what's most profitable yeah. and put your mining. Yeah, so, so mining, obviously, if you're buying equipment like this, is different from doing it on your home computer. But fundamentally, the principle's the same, you know? Um, it's dead simple to get involved these days, so it's, it's kind of is open for everyone, and that's a really exciting thing.